Hello guys and welcome. In this video tutorial I am going to show how to connect to your database using ASP.NET with C Sharp. First of all I am going to create a new project and this is going to be an ASP.NET empty web application project. I'll name it as DB Connection. Now since this is an empty project I'm going to add a web form. Right click on this area here, go add and new pro item. Choose a web form. Here you can name whatever you want. I'm going to name home my web form. Go to design mode. I'm going to add a button and a grid view to this page. Now what I'm going to do here is when you click on the button you're going to load data from database into the grade view. So I'm going to load students and change this to load student let's say. Before I start typing any code I'm going to create a connection stick on my web config file. So open your web config file and here I'm going to open a connection string. So here I'm going to open a connection string. Connection string will contain three parts. Name, connection string and provider name. So let's add first name. Uh, I'm going to give a name dbcon connection string this will be my connection string and provider name in provider name just type system dot data and SQL client so pretty much we are done with our connection string with specified connection string on web config file. Close this and double click on the button. Now here I'm going to create public string variable for my connection string. So type public string. I'm going to name it as CS equals configuration manager dot connection string here I'm going to open a curly brackets and we'll pass the connection string name which we specified on web.config file which was dbcon dot connection string Now I'm going to use this variable on my button click event handler. I'm going to use using statement, so type using SQL connection con as name equals new SQL connection and in SQL connection I'm going to pass the parameter the variable I've created in here which is CS now SQL command I'm going to create new object for SQL command which will be CMD equals new SQL command now my SQL command will contain two parameters. First parameter will be the select statement which I'm going to type select star from students and connection which is con for my case and I'm going to open the connection now to show the data 
from database in the grid view we should bind to grid view so type grid view data source equals to command execute reader and grid view data bind now save this and run the project now when I click on this button I should get the grid view with data loaded from database as you can see it worked successfully so this is how you can connect to your database using ASP.NET with C Sharp thanks for watching bye